Hey there everyone, this is Danielle, taking a quick look at Part-Time UFO. Uh, this is like a puzzle game, I think? I don't know much about it. Uh, it's made by HAL Laboratories, the folks who made the Kirby games and also the Box Boy games. You might recognise the art style, looks kind of like Box Boy. Uh, I haven't played this one at all, I don't know much about it. Apparently, apparently it's cute. Uh, hopefully it'll be fun. I think it's a puzzle game where the UFO has to go around and help people with stuff. Not quite sure what makes you a part-time UFO as opposed to a full-time one. Like, you think you're always a UFO if that's what you are. Dag nabbit, my precious giant oranges. These old bones can't get them back on the truck. Huh? You, the young and drifting around. Could you help me? Put the cargo on the truck. I guess, like, UFO is unidentified flying objects, so if part of the time people know who you are, or part of the time you're not flying, you're a part-time UFO, right? Hover over the object you want to grab, then press uh, A or B to lower your claw. If the UFO gets too close to a gravel object, you won't be able to bring it- bring out the claw. Alright. To let go of the object you were grabbing, press the button again. Okay. Um, yeah, it seems pretty simple. Blinking objects are important. Work is done when you load enough blinking cargo to reach the goal. You can get a bonus for loading the other cargo too. But if you don't finish in time, you'll lose the bonus. That's right, there's no reward for working overtime. That's messed up. I guess it's like a physics puzzler sort of thing. Uh, you can use the left stick to move. You cannot use the D-pad to move, which is interesting. You have to use the left analog. You get out of the way. So yeah, it's a bit of a physics puzzler sort of thing by the looks of things. It's fairly straightforward. There's a big orange over here. I'll grab everything, it's not too tricky. <laughs> Yay! I did good work. Uh, I can press share? What does that do? Oh, I see, it takes a, takes a screenshot using the switch screenshot thingy, uh, and then I can't do much with it. <laughs> Unable to share. Yeah, I know, I cancelled. UFO sighting. Okay. Continue. Your pay... Uh, I don't know what that means, but I guess I got it. You can get medals by completing secret goals while working. As you earn more medals, you'll open up more job opportunities. Oh, I see. Putting the oranges in the big green crate and putting the boxes the right way up. And that's not all. Earn all three medals in a job and you'll unlock a more challenging plus plus, sorry, star star version of the job. I said plus plus because I've been like looking at C plus plus a lot recently. <laughs> okay. That really helped. Here's your pay. Go ahead and take it. Hmm? Is this the first time you've ever been paid for work? You young'uns drift around doing nothing with your lives? Well, I ain't gonna stand for it. Help this alien drift to settle down on Earth, the man hands the UFO a magazine with job listings. And so begins the UFO's life on Earth. You don't have to do jobs all the time. You can do other things. Part-time UFO. Copyright 2020 HAL Laboratory, Inc. Uh, I've got some options. Let me see. Uh, I have a shop. What can I buy at the shop? Let's have a quick look. Ooh, a customer! 
Welcome to the first Earth branch of the Cosmic Apparel Shop. I tried to make this place fit in with your Earth scenery, but it seems like only kids shop here. But you found us, yay! And I can tell that you're a big generous spender. We've got all kinds of stuff, even outfits that will make you fly around a bit differently. Okay, so these cost a thousand, whatever the money is each. Little spaceships, they look like. Can I preview these things? Or do I... Package deliverer. The package always gets there. That'll be a thousand. No, I can't preview. Hmm, it's a bit annoying. Oh, some of these are super cute. Okay, so very similarly to, uh... You know, the, the, the Box Boy games, you've got a bunch of different alternate costumes and stuff you can buy. <laughs> Realistic UFO. <laughs> That's pretty funny. Uh, let's, let's find work. Okay, so... Uh, let's go back to the first one and try to do those hidden things. Work. Do we have to do them all in one go, or can we do them separately? Uh, okay, so this we want to put it the right way up. So what we want to do is... Uh, something like this. Oop, not quite, not quite. Is there a button to, like, rotate? Or something? Okay, there we go, that did it. Oops, that didn't do what I wanted. Big orange goes in the crate. Get out of the way, big crate. Oh, oh no! <laughs> a lot of cute stuff going on in the background, which I think is nice. Okay, let's grab this one. Ah, uh, can we I can use that to push the others across a bit? Or maybe. Oop, oop, yes! Yep, there we go. And then I'll put it over here. I wonder if all the levels have this kind of music or if it's like different in different parts of the game. Uh, hmm. That's not gonna work. Can I pick this up first and then bring it over? Yeah, okay, so we'll bring this over. Bring this over. And quickly go and grab the other stuff. Quick! We're running out of time! I don't know if I need to do them all in one go. If I do, then I'm gonna have to try again. Probably. You won't get a bonus if the time goes down to zero. You can pause by pressing plus, which will give you the option to restart the job from the beginning. Okay, so the bonus time is gone, but maybe I can still get the other medals? Let's find out. That's a long drum roll. Show off your awesome work to everyone who's not working. <laughs> and upload it on social media. Or not if you're not on social media. Show off, I'm going to give you a special illustration commemorating that job. Yeah. Okay, let's see. Do I get all the medals now? Okay, I got the other two. I think I need to do all three of them in one job in order to get the, the special star version. Maybe not? Oh no, I've got it. Look. Two stars. There we go. Okay, um, let's move on to the next job, though. Catch the fish moving all around. Ahoy and hooray! Load five fish on board and then we sail away. Okay, I can see there's a bunch of fish down there. Come here, fish. Come here, fish. I wonder if I want, like, different types of fish? That would be a logical thing. Can I go underwater? Nope. UFO cannot swim. Okay. 
That's a different type of roof, I think. Hopefully that's all I need. Let's see how we go. I like the music. It kind of reminds me of Rayman Origins, if that makes sense. Oh, okay, I missed whatever the middle one is. Is there, like, a way to find out what it's supposed to be that I missed? Hmm. Oh, page two is unlocked. Can I... No, you can't scroll up and have a look. It looks like a... like a sea urchin or something? Let's see if I can find one. Oh, there it is. Underneath this fish. Out of the way, fish. Yeah, I got it. Okay, so I'll just drop this over here. Oh, no, 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 no! <laughs> I rolled away! <laughs> oh, this is a silly game. Okay, um, let's grab a normal fish first so we got something to, like, block it off with. Come here, you. Okay, now that should probably be enough. Oh, let's, oops. Just grab another fish accidentally, because why not? Okay. Action time, here we go. Okay, so I put it all the way over here. It shouldn't be able to roll away. Okay, cool. Looks like the action doesn't count towards the five fish, which is interesting. <laughs> okay, cool. Feats of Glory? Is that like achievements? This is the Feats of Glory page. Attempt the challenges shown here. Complete four in the same square. You unlock a UFO memory. Okay, it's not much, but it is whimsical. <laughs> oh, I've got a bunch already. Okay, I see. Nine medals, buy one outfit at the shop, transport 40 objects, workplace efficiency, high seas look. Okay, so yeah, there's a bunch of different achievements and stuff. Okay, um. Okay, if I buy some of the uh, outfits, that'll help towards that. And I can't afford a couple now. Why am I glad to see you? These earthlings generate the first thing about space fashion. Beanie Man. Warm. That makes it easy to go slow. That'll be a thousand. There you go. Ooh, that really brings out your curves. Really? Psst, between you and me. If you press L or R during a job, something cool happens. And what happens changes, depending on what you're wearing. Isn't that fun? Give it a try. I will. Drum Major. Lead yourself down the path of victory. That'll be a thousand little spaceships. Uh, yeah. Package Deliverer? Oh, that one's cute. Uh... Worker Bee? Oh, look, I'm a little bee! That's adorable. <laughs> I'm thinking this might be a short video because this game is relatively straightforward. Uh, let's see how we go, though. I assume this is how you change to different outfits, now that I have some. Yeah, cool. <laughs> Technically, you're still wearing something. Uh, let's try going into a level with Beanie Man and see what happens.
Uh, does Strike Farm 2? Do you need to... It looks like the medals are already done. I don't know if you do the, three, the same three things again, or... If... We'll find out. Put the cargo on the truck. Okay, there's a bunch of other stuff here too. Pumpkins and stuff. I think they're pumpkins. Okay, okay, so pressing L or R makes this happen. It's like a little emote sort of thing, I guess. Get out of there, pumpkins. There we go. Oops. Okay, okay, we're doing well. Give me a little orange. Get into the truck. Give me a little orange. Get into the truck. Give me a larger orange. Oops. Uh. Oh, I didn't get a time bonus for that one? Oh, I did. Okay, it's just a bit delayed. Go over there, pumpkin. Are they pumpkins? Like, pumpkins aren't usually green, right? They're all orange, like oranges. Okay, I can probably get this upright if I put it sort of this sort of direction. Oop. Put it in like that. Yeah, that did the trick. Uh, then I want to grab that little orange if I can reach it. There's a bunch of stuff in the way. I, I can just push stuff around with my UFO body. <laughs> you go over there. Let's lift this up first and get out of the way. I know it'll end the mission if we put that into the truck, so I'm just gonna leave it over there for now. And then go grab the other one. Yeah, it's, it's a pretty simple game. Okay, and then we want this one. Let's put it on top of the other one, and that should do the trick. Yeah. <laughs> Yay. Okay, so did I get more medals? Uh, looks like it. Also money. <laughs> or did I... No, I didn't get more medals, I think. I think it's the same medals? Yeah, you don't get them again. Hmm, fair enough. Well, let's go this way. <laughs> oh, I forgot to change outfits. Hang on, I want to go change outfits before doing this. We can go home. Um, uh, let's see, what's... Let's be a worker bee, since we're doing some construction. <laughs> Okay, so we want pillars that are at 90 degrees, we want, like, a friend underneath the pillars, and we want the time. I think. <laughs> oh, I see the friend. Put up the pillars and add a roof. Let's build a temple. Okay, the bee is much quicker than the other one. So, yeah, the costume you wear does have a significant impact on the gameplay, by the looks of things. Which is interesting. How many are you? We're gonna go in the temple, friend. I like how there's all these little friends in the background. I think it's pretty cute. Okay, yeah. Come on. We wanna get it the right way up. Yeah. Come on, let's do this. Physics! <laughs> Okay, 
There we go. And then the roof, which is this piece. Here we go. I'm not sure if I need to put the pillars closer together. I guess we'll find out. No, that was perfect. <laughs> okay. This, this is cute. I have some more feats of glory now, right? Sure do. We're getting there. Uh, let's jump back in and do the next one. Tower of Infinity? I'm interested. Just pile them high. Alright. Is there a time limit or is it like if it topples you lose? Pile the object as high as you can. Okay, so there is a time limit. Where are the objects? Is this, is this what I want? The pinata? Okay. Uh, can I have some objects that are like reasonably shaped? Please? Okay, let's try to establish a bit of a foundation first. So I'll put this here. There we go. Uh, then we get, like, a weird squid thing. Okay. I think the bee is a bit too quick for this. Some of the other costumes are a bit slower and more methodical. Oh no. Don't fall. Stay up. Oh no. This is terrifying. Okay, let's go put that there. <laughs> um, why is everything so weirdly shaped? Magic block? What? What, is, what does that do? Hmm. No idea. Yeah, I definitely want a slower, more precise move form for this this uh, tower challenge, rather than the the bee, which buzzes all over the place and is very chaotic. Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> oh, I lost some objects. Oh dear. Okay, yeah, I get it. Fun. <laughs> Is team up the two player mode? Invite a friend to tackle the job together. Okay, so two UFOs, local co op. That's cool. Uh, let's try the next uh, job and then I think probably call it because I think you get the idea of the game. I don't think it needs a whole hour of viewing. Let L E T S G O. Oh, let's go. Cheers, squad. Let's do this. Take it three and a half meters high. Okay. So am I stacking this, the actual cheerlead? Yeah, I am. Okay, let's go. <laughs> oh my goodness. Yeah, I I need to change I need to change costumes. The B is just this is way too chaotic. Uh, what else have I got? Uh, let's try. <laughs> Drum mage is probably the right choice, right? For cheerleaders. Yeah, that probably works out. <laughs> Let's go, cheer squad. Okay. Uh, my L button makes me toss a little pennant thingy. And yeah, I'm much slower and more precise this way by the looks of things. That's probably good. <laughs> you look astonished. <laughs> You okay there? 
Oh, they're a bit wobbly. What did they think was going to happen when the UFO got here? <laughs> they seem very startled. Come here, you. I don't think he's going to be tall enough. We'll see. Oh no. Oh my god. <laughs> I've clearly done something wrong here. Um, okay, let's take you off, because you're not in the right spot. You just, just go over there. <laughs> okay, then we want you over here. Like, just lying flat on top of everyone, basically. No, don't slide. Okay, there we go. That'll work. Then I can grab you and put you on top. You seem very scared. <laughs> okay, so yeah, this is a silly game. <laughs> okay, drop. Is that tall enough? I forget what I wanted. Well, uh, it's good work, apparently. Three point five meters for the other metal. I came close. Three point four. Okay, yeah, I can do one more to get it to about a half hour. Uh, I'll try another outfit as well. Package delivery. Big Philip J. Fry vibes. Put away the toys and don't forget to put the lid back on. Alright. I like to put away toys. It's closing time. Put away the toys. Make sure to close the box. Uh, so this is the box. Okay, so I've got to open the box first. Lots of things. How do I do that? Oh, the, oh I see. Just, just pull the lid off. But, like, better. There we go. <laughs> Let's chuck it over there. Okay. Let's start chucking things into the box. <laughs> these toys are ridiculously shaped. Come here, little... What are these? Hula hoops? Okay. I'm gonna grab the lid. Just move it over the other side. Also, yeah, that's my L button thing, a little doorbell. The R button seems to always be a little thumbs up, regardless of what costume you pick. Grab this little hoo, put it in there. Don't forget all this stuff. Oh, it's just a chicken. Alright, get in there, chicken. And I guess I'll bring this box with me too. Box in a box. And then the lid goes back on. <laughs> Yay, good work. I was meant to put the hoops onto the- Oh, I see. That makes more sense. Hoops do not go in the box. Hoops go on the box. <laughs> How are we doing Feats of Glory wise? Oh, we have a full section. Let's check out the memory. Memory of the farm. Okay, so it's not much. You just see this little animation. Huh. I mean, that's pretty cute, but yeah, like they said, it's not much, but it's something. <laughs> cool. Um, well, yeah, this has part-time UFO, a silly physics game that looks super fun, actually. 
<laughs> um, yeah, that's about it for this video. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Bye! Hehehehe. <laughs>